very good morning everybody so this is our next class in our second subject hrm human resource management so far we have discussed in detail the concept of hr today we shall go into more detail and we shall figure out what are the important activities or we can say functions or processes of human resource management so as you look at this diagram you may have got the picture of all the processes activities and functions of human resource management so far as far as the whole scope and area or functionalities of human resource management are concerned we can bifurcate all those functions and activities into two broad categories of functions the one category is managerial functions and the other category is the core functions or we can say the main functions of human resource management now as far as the first category managerial functions is concerned you are much acquainted with these functions like planning organizing directing and controlling these are the basic functions which are performed by every manager at each level of the organization so these are typically or particularly called specific managerial functions performed by a manager in the organization so these managerial functions are common in every functional areas of management and at every level of the organization so we call them basic functions or also managerial functions now as far as the main concern the main crux of our subject that is hrm human resource management or managing human resources what are the basic functions what are the important core functions of human resource management are these we can bifurcate or we can categorize into core functions core means main functions as far as managerial functions we have already you are much acquainted with them because they studied them all in bba in first year in under principles of management so if you have any kind of i don't think you have any kind of doubt regarding planning or planning directing and controlling next is concerned with core functions so these are the core functions in front of you what are the core functions first is procurement number two development number three compensation number four integration and number five maintenance and number six separation all what human resources so how to procure procure means how to get as an hr manager your duty is to procure human resources or talent or skilled people in your organization in your organization and fill the gap of people fill the positions and uh, posts which are vacant so how do you procure human resources from society into your organization next development when human resources when employees we have recruited them you have selected them or you find them very suitable for your organization you have to give them their training and develop their skills and knowledge base it is regarding with your processes and work of your organization so this that comes under development then you have to also craft a compensation plan which is their salary and remuneration what perks and releases they have their pay packages everything regarding they are concerning the resources and available budget of the organization you have to draft draft their salary packages that is called your compensation what you will pay them what organization will pay then you have to decide as a hr manager integration you have to see every organization there is a coordination is a team work so how will you integrate that particular person a new person newcomer fresher who is coming in your organization how will you integrate him how will you how will you put him in the process of your organization how you will gel with the organization how will understand the organization so all of this and the integration we have induction placement processes which we we'll discuss in later detail 
how this new person will be taken into your organization and he will develop with the other people as well to work efficiently and effectively. Maintenance, maintenance means continuous supply of human resources or skilled people to the organization. Nowadays, this is very, very important task, how to, how to attract the talent and how once you have attracted them, once employees, talented, good employees have reached your organization, then you have to give them proper, suitable motivation, communication, as well as sir, uh, many perks and incentives so that they remain with your organization, they do not switch. Uh, that is called maintaining the human resource supply in your organization and separation. You also have to, as HR manager, you also have to craft the plans of how a person will end its relationship with the organization in terms of formal separation, informal separation. That we discuss in detail how an employee get detached from the organization in various forms. Under this, we will discuss retirement, layoffs, dismissal, and some more options are there in which an employee is separated from the organization. So these are the very basic functions of human resource management. That's why there are all four functions that we'll discuss in next portion of this topic. Till then, thank you so much. Have a good time. Bye.